Hey, uh, so I just wanted to take everybody through our process of how we got to this board, which is now what we what we call the Grom. Um, if anybody doesn't know what a Grom is, a Grom is a young surfer. So it was basically designed for somebody who is getting into handboarding. That's not to say that you can't use it if you're taking on some big stuff. I've been in some big stuff in Costa Rica on this and it was fun because you get a lot of buoyancy because of the foam, it's very light and it's very buoyant. So you can actually get up, and especially on those long breaking waves. I've had um, like two in and out barrels on them. Yeah, it works on everything, but that was what it was designed for. That's why it's called the Grom. As you can see, all the different shapes, and these are only the ones that I saved. Honestly, like there were so many, I don't like, we had like too many to keep. I really wanted something that was um, just awesome, like kind of like a little stubby. I love the uh, kind of almost kind of fishy style wing, um, uh, tail. I love that. And you know, it really needed to say soft, I guess. Something that isn't gonna take your eye out. It's not a performance board. And so we needed the shape to portray that. You know, we went with the shape that we really thought looked super cool. The material we used to shape initially is uh, urethane. It does really fine details. This is actually, the original of that like so what happens is we'll shape it into that this really gets when you scan it in because you have to scan it in onto 3d program you really get those awesome angles and those awesome tight corners materials we'll be using um, is an IXL and that has really sharp graphics on it and um, an HDPE and then it has a core water resistant closed cell styrene it's taken over a year and a half to get to where we are right now um, but we are super proud of where it's at and um, I don't stop until I get exactly what I want which is this so I'm super proud of it and I hope you guys like it so go ride the ground